my channel and today I'm doing my detailed wing liner tutorial as requested by you guys from my everyday makeup tutorial which you guys actually have to check out because I am completely in love with that look and I only use one palette so it's perfect for a lazy girl like me and this wing liner technique has been in progress for the longest time ever since I started doing wing liner I have to say that the wing liner is one of the hardest eyeliner technique. With my own eyelid, the hurdles that I had to cross to creating the perfect wing liner, a slight hooding of my eye. Now hooding is a very natural thing that occurs with age. Now I don't know if you guys know, but I'm almost 30. So it's actually natural for my eyes to start drooping. And what that is, is basically the skin above your crease starts to droop over. Now you can't really see this normally in my tutorials because I look down, but when I look up, you can see that it's starting to droop and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. I just had to adjust my techniques to pretty much suit my new eyelid. The other thing that stopped me getting the perfect wing line the first time is also the crease that I have. I guess droops a little bit towards the edges. What this does is it makes it hard for me to draw the wing line and when I open my eyes, the wing actually kind of folds in each other and it makes it kind of like a weird curve line. Also, if I drew my wing liner a little bit too like wide and I open my eyes without letting the eyeliner dry, I'd get this weird imprint. It, it, it really made me sad a lot of the times. So I wanted to share this technique with you guys in detail. If you guys are having any of these issues, it may help you. <laughs> So the first thing I like to do is extend my liner out and what this does is I can create the wing a lot further out which helps me avoid that crease that creates a lot of trouble. I extend it out naturally either straight you can do a slightly up angle as well. I use a guide from the edge of to the end of my eyebrows as kind of like a guide for the angle and then from there I do the usual triangle by joining the tip down towards my lids. What else I like to do as well is avoid adding a lot of volume or a thick line above my pupils. The reason for this is I really like the wing look to be long and fierce instead of like round and by adding a lot of liner above your pupil it makes your eyes look really round. I basically have a very thin line all along my upper lash line until I get to the wing. Add concealer if you made any mistakes or use eye makeup remover if you need to change anything. Because I've elongated my eye I I also extend my lower lash line out to kind of like match the top extension. Do this or not, it's really up to you, but I feel like it blends in the look a lot better. And I would use a pencil liner for this or a gel liner. And then after that, you can apply mascara on the bottom lashes and the top lashes as well. What you want to do with a wing liner is definitely concentrate the mascara on the lashes on the outer edge of your eye because that's really going to lift the corners of your eyes up. But I find that my lashes aren't actually long enough to create a huge difference and plus I draw the wing liner quite dramatically. So what I like to do is use falsies to do this and I love this pair of falsies by Tiny Wings because they are so soft, they're really flattering. I've literally lived in this if you've seen all my past videos, I'm wearing this. But once you've applied the lashes on, you can see how the lashes have just blended in that wing liner to the point where it just looks like it really just belongs to the look. Maybe lashes are the answer to, you know, making your wing liner look perfect. If you found this video helpful in any way, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Let's try and get it to 9,000 thumbs up. That would make me so happy. And in a few days, I'm going to be doing the chubby bunny challenge on this channel. You guys have to watch it. It's so funny. To my lovely family, I love you guys so, 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 so much. And I'll see you right back here in a few days. Bye!